Jesus Dampy, welcome to a, another live stream. This is going to be my second live stream on uh, Super Mario Maker 2. Uh, I didn't know how much I was going to stream this game. Uh, and then I did the first stream and I don't know how many of you were around for the first stream. But um, let me just make sure you can hear me. Can you hear me? You can. You can hear me. Good. Uh, yeah, the first stream was just so much fun. It was just such a ridiculous stream. I got stuck on one level for ages and I almost gave up, but I didn't give up and I just about completed it. Uh, it was craziness. And so hopefully uh, today uh, is going to be uh, as fun as, uh, as that day was. Uh, hello, everyone. Uh, start the stream already. I have started the stream, Charlie. There was a slight delay. Everyone's so impatient on YouTube. <laughs> like, the second you start, like, the stream going, which is the starting soon screen, and I'm just, like, doubly, like, checking everything, making sure it's all working. Like, it was on that screen for, like, three minutes, and everyone's like, I'm bored, I'm leaving. It's like, like, if I didn't start that screen, you wouldn't even know. It's funny, like, when I'm, like, like, BRB for a second. Like, I guess there's people just joining in uh, just then and kind of have no idea what's uh, what's going on. Um, right then, uh, how's everyone doing? Hello, great to see you, says uh, Fintan CD. Um, yeah, good to, to see you too. Welcome to, to joining the, the stream. Uh, could you please turn the, the sound up? Like, my mic is, like, super loud. Uh, there's not really any, like, there's no other background music or, or anything. So, uh, yeah, if you just turn the whole stream up, you should be able to hear okay. Uh, how are you doing, champ, says Popular Cookie. I'm doing good. It's like a really really cold wet and rainy day like it's only it's not even like 4 p.m here and it's basically just completely dark already and i got like a window just to my side here and just the trees going crazy and it's like rain splattering on the window it's a, it's a good day to be like indoors playing video games like <laughs> it's like like a lot of people are like i like the sun like i like the rain like i like the sun when i'm outside but I like the rain because I spend so much time inside playing video games. Like, it's nice to see all the horribleness outside and being like here, wrapped up in a blanket, just playing video games and doing a bit of streaming. Uh, shout out to, to Aiden for the uh, the $2 donation who says, Happy Tuesday. Is that a thing we say? Is happy... T Can you just say happy that a day of the week? Happy Tuesday, everyone. Can we get some... Uh, Happy Tuesdays in the, the chat. <laughs> Just so we can say Happy Tuesday to everyone. Uh, I love your hair, says Battle Royale Boys. Thank you so much. Uh, jealous of your of your cold weather. Oh, Flying Flicker! <laughs> I was reading your comment. I didn't really read it. Uh, Flying Flicker uh, is uh, one of my friends from Florida. And uh, yeah, Florida doesn't really get cold weather. They get like very, very hot weather and then just normal hot weather. <laughs> Everyone's saying Happy Tuesday. <laughs> oh, dear. All right, how about we well, should, we, uh, should we play? So I was... Just going to go and do what I did last time and do some of the popular courses, like some of the best courses, uh, and then maybe do some courses that have been built by you guys. Uh, but then I loaded up the game and then there was this screen. Uh, it said, oh, let me just get rid of my face so you can read it for a second. Yeah. Introducing ninji speedruns. Uh, compete with makers around the globe for world records. You can also earn new gear by beating these courses and collecting stamps. <laughs> I don't think it's talking like, I don't think you collect me. <laughs> collecting stamps. It's funny because that's like what most people do by like as a nickname for me. They just call me stamps. That's kind of weird uh, reading that. Uh, yeah, so I don't know what this is. It seems like obviously some sort of speed running thing. I don't know how long this has been in the, the game, but it says one day left. Um, so I don't really... I don't really know what this is. This might just be like one little short thing we do at the, the beginning of the, the stream and then carry on playing. Uh, but I guess we can end, uh, yeah, we can investigate it together. People saying happy Christmas, Taco Tuesday. Uh, Gacha has homework, sorry. Hopefully you can, this can be on in the, the background. I'll try not to be uh, too too distracting. Uh, right then, so is it just one? Is it just one level and I need to try and do it as fast as I can? Make your way through the snow fields and keep an eye out for spikes and snow pokies. Uh, stomping on snow pokies uh, will turn them into small snowballs, uh, which you can pick up and throw. Uh, play this course as many times as you want and see if you can find the fastest way to finish it. I mean, I'm not going to get the world record, am I? I mean, look how many people have played it. <laughs> like 400,000 people have played it. I guess we could all, uh, um, uh, we could all play it together if you have this game. And you want to see whether you can uh, beat my my personal best. Look out for googlies, says Sonic the, the Hedgehog. I will do. I'll have to jump at all the googlies' heads. Right, okay. So I think the first time I... Oh, hello, 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 hello. Oh, dear. Okay, that was a bad start. They're like... They're snowballs just like golf balls, don't they? So, yeah. First time running through, I'm assuming isn't going to be a, um, <laughs> a good time. So let's just try and learn the level and then we'll see how far as we go. So can I jump up to here? I can. If I make my way up to the top... 
Okay, it's so a bit of a, an all over the place level. So what I think you want to do is you probably want to try and get as high as you can at first and then slide down the slopes, which is kind of the uh, the fastest way to, to make your way down. Then what did it say about like, can I jump on the snowballs or do I just pick them up? Okay. And then what's the, the power ups? Is there anything that's going to make me go quicker? That's just a mushroom. I probably won't want to be like dealing with that. To be fair, I'm probably not going to pick up a mushroom at all if I'm trying to go quickly. Uh, to nail a perfect speed run, it takes precision and determination. Good luck. I don't know if they're, uh, they're two traits that I, <laughs> I particularly have. It's quite a long course, actually. I kind of want to see what the, um, like, the overall, like, world record for this is. Uh, thank you, uh, Galaxy Wolfie, for the, uh, for the donation. I can already feel like I'm not going to be able to do this, uh, do this very quickly. So I just need to get up to the top. So if I jump here, then I can jump on... Oh, I think that might be the way to start this. Is if I jump right on that guy and get straight to that, like, next level. If I go, like, boom. But ah, off the snowball. And then I might be able to land on the next snowball that's going down as well. Right. And we're spending way too long on just as look. If I go, dung. And then... Okay, that, that was all right. It's just hard because that next guy is throwing down snowballs. Unleash your ninja power stamps. I'm trying to. So I go, boom. Just one boom. Just one boom. <laughs> I don't know how much longer we're doing this for. Let's just try and get one one semi-decent run uh, through this if we can. Uh, first things, take a deep breath and focus on clearing the course. Whew. That was a beautiful start. Oh, and then I ruined it. That was a really good start, though. Right, I'm going to start again. I'm going to start again. If I can do that again, that would be perfect. Uh, get the, the mushroom. I don't think the mushroom will make me go quicker. Obviously, it will make me survive. But uh, I'm not just trying to get to the end of the level. I'm trying to do it in a good time. I think, like, getting the mushroom is just going to be a waste. Like, if I can get through without getting hit, it's just going to be a waste of time. Your voice is so cute and funny. I love it. <laughs> okay, that was okay. I think I'm ending up going down too low. But I'll, I'll, I'll settle for that. There was just that bit where I had to do like the um, like the, the wall jump to get up. And I think that really slowed me down last time. Coffee or tea will help you focus, says Aiden. <laughs> yeah, I might need that. Might need that in a bit. Perfect. Oh, look at that. And then slide down. I think that's got to be the way to do it. But then like like jump up to the top on that bit up there. Slide down through you. Jump on you. Oh, here we go. Here we go. And then I can knock that to take care of these guys. Probably should have knocked that snowball down. Ah, then yeah, if I knock that snowball down, that might have taken out that enemy. And then I get to the end. That was a good go. That was pretty good. Could I repeat that though is the question. Apparently not. I sense a Mario Maker graph coming. Record is 20 seconds. You know what? I wasn't actually too far off 20 seconds then. I wasn't actually like, I'm not going to get the like 400,000 people who are better than me have played this. <laughs> like, I'm not going to get the world record, but I wasn't like crazy far off it. Uh, you should play Link's Awakening. I've already, I've already played Link's Awakening. I didn't do any videos on it or anything, uh, but I played through it. It was a lot of fun. I think maybe if I just pick up that snowball and just drop it just to take out the enemy. But if I just do, oh, or I could just bang my head into it. <laughs> From is I'm focusing way too much on just this first beginning bit. And then like not getting any practice on the later bits. So annoying. I think I'm just jumping like slightly too. I think I'm just jumping too far. My record is 21 uh, seconds, right? I'll see if I can beat you. I don't know if I should try and jump on the uh, the first snowball or the one that's going down. I think maybe jumping on the second one might be the, the better way to go. Let's just carry on with this run for a little bit. Just so we can see a little bit uh, little bit rest of the, the level. I hate this map too, says Mickey Mouse. <laughs> yeah, so has this been like a long running thing? I haven't played Mario Maker since like the last stream. I didn't know that they the, they were doing this. It's cool like to get everyone to like focus on one map. So everyone's just training on the, the same level as they go. But yeah, I think we'll switch around and just do some uh, some of the uh, the normal crazier levels after this. I'm just like really inconsistent. Like sometimes I seem to bounce really high off them. And sometimes I don't. 
I think, I don't know if I'm jumping like, I just never know if I'm jumping too early or too late. If I just try it like different every time, so it sometimes works and sometimes doesn't. Ooh, okay, that was all right. Well, that was good. Okay. Then slide down here. Oh, why did they put him right there? <laughs> I'm sliding down. <laughs> okay, we actually got to see a little bit more of the, the level then at least. <laughs> okay, this is definitely not going to be a fast time, but let's... uh. Keep it going, nonetheless. Oh, no. I don't even like actually like finish the level yet, have I? I've always been like hit by that last one at the at the end. just so tricky when there's like the enemy like up the the top you know i think i'm just gonna finish the level and then just do some other levels i know i'm not gonna get a great time let's just let's just let's just focus on trying to get to the end of the, the level this go and just set whatever my whatever time i end up getting or i could just go and <laughs> jump down into that pit instead catch your play says hello i just joined welcome we're doing like it's like a speed run thing so everyone's got to like play the same level and then it's like trying to get the world record I think it's pretty unlikely that I'm going to be the, the one to get the world record, but we keep trying. It's just this guy's such a pain. There we go. I took him out. That was just for my personal satisfaction. <laughs> and then this bit's annoying with all of these guys. You need to get like one good bounce on one of them to get over the, the rest of them. Uh, what did you think of Frozen 2? I loved Frozen 2. Like, I wasn't like a crazy fan for Frozen 1. Like, I'm much more of a... um. Uh, a Pixar fan uh, than like the more kind of traditional like like Disney princess musical and everyone's happy at the the end. I kind of more prefer uh, Pixar, but I thought Frozen One was okay and like the songs were pretty crap, uh, pretty catchy, but overplayed. But yeah, Frozen Two was great. I think it's probably like as good as Frozen One. I would say. Like, what's the uh, like no spoilers, but what does everyone else think of Frozen Two? Like, do people like it as much as the the first one? More or less. The odds are not in your favor. Ignore the odds. Oh, no. Thanks for the uh, the donation again, Galaxy Wolfie. Okay. Oh, this is go. Okay, this might be a. Eh, that wasn't great. Still not the uh, the worst go in the world though. If I can keep this going. The thing is, like, I'm just skipping all like the uh, the mushrooms to try and go quicker, which is making it a uh, much more deadly, especially when there's a million <laughs> snowmen coming down. <laughs> oh, and I still didn't get through. Still didn't make. It. I think I need to like knock the uh, knock the giant snowball down and then keep going. Ew, this is okay. No! Oh, that was almost going to be a good one. Uh, Aiden says Halo Reach is, uh, is $10 out on uh, on PC now. I've been playing a, a lot of Halo Reach, but I've just been playing it on Xbox. Brings back uh, brings me back to the old channel, yeah. I used to, uh, to play a lot of that game. Oh, yeah, we were playing that last night, me and Squishy. Right, let's just finish this level, and then we're going to another level, because this is a... Uh... <laughs> This is this is time to get a bit repetitive. Right, I'm just gonna really take my time with this one. All right, I'm just gonna actually uh, actually grab this this time. It's quite good doing these challenges because like. People that aren't very good at the game, like me, <laughs> like they're going to be able to complete the level because like the level isn't very difficult. 
But for then, like, the people that are crazy good at the game, like, they're just going to play it in, like, a completely different way. So, like, everyone can complete it and set a time, but just the really good people are just going to play it in, like, such a different way. Right, 35 seconds is my absolutely atrocious time. That's going to be my personal best, because I'm probably not going to play this level uh, again. Very impressive move, Stampy. I didn't know you were able to speedrun. Like, it's hard to tell in the text, but I'm assuming there was some uh, some sarcasm in there. <laughs> right, let's uh, let's change the uh, the title of the, the stream. Ah, so is this like the, the average? Oh, so my rank, my rank is 261st found. To be fair, I'm like, I'm around the, the middle. So it's not actually that bad. And I had one, uh, one, like, attempt where if I didn't die right at the end, it would have been about 21 seconds. So that's like, that would have, that would have been high up if I didn't end up failing. Uh, you can now race against Ninja Ghost. Try to beat your personal record. Uh, you can just the number of Ninja Ghost run. Okay, this is quite a cool thing then. We are going to do a bit of variety though and play around with some other levels. Uh, 50 set. Thanks for the uh, the donation. Uh, oh, it won't let me... I was doing this the, the other day. It's not letting me actually scroll down to, to see it. One second. Let me see what the, uh, the, the message was. Because I make like the text quite big, so I can see the like the chat quite well. Because otherwise I'm like just squinting the whole stream. I spend the whole stream like this, <laughs> just trying to see what everyone's saying. Uh, oh, so the tall spiky things are the pokies throwing the snowballs at the spikes. Uh, could you also play Untitled Goose Game? So I've already played quite a lot of Untitled Goose Game, so I probably won't play it uh, again uh, on stream. It was a lot of fun, though. I did actually see today they announced that uh, Untitled Goose Gamer is going to be coming out on PS4. That's going to be cool, because there's going to be a whole load of people um, that hadn't had a chance to play it before that will now get to, to play it. Uh, Delta's Rage says, Awaken your Inner Ninja. Uh, release it when ready. I've been storing up my Inner Ninja, but I haven't released it yet, as you uh, as you all saw. Uh, right then, uh, what should we do? The, the top rated one at the moment is called Skillful uh, Platformer. And only 4% of people have completed it. Uh, let's give it a go. Okay. Right, I think we've gone from like a... A relatively easy level to a much trickier one. Oh! Oh, I need to wait till it drops under. And then like loop around underneath. So I need to go like this. Then, oh, I need to jump that and then go weep. Oh, okay. I think I need to be a little bit quicker getting to the, the button. Then go. I need to jump like, I need to like jump to like right on the right hand side. I don't feel so bad because there's like so many X's there from other people that have died in that same place. Maybe if I run underneath there, there we go. Okay, that's what I need to do. I need to run just further to the right when I can. I go, whoop, there we go, okay. And now I'm going to risk getting the coin, and then jump up. Okay, then little jump there, and then loop back down to there. Yeah, so I just need to basically go in another big, like, full circle there. Like, they're not difficult jumps, they're all, like, um, just quite tight. Like, you don't have much room. Alright, let's, uh, let's not worry about the coin for this one. Let's just try and make my way across. And now I make my way back across. And then, oh, okay, we've got a checkpoint. Get the checkpoint. Let's go here, then here. And I need to go like that, and then like that, and back over. Whew, okay. Oh, this is so scary. I haven't had a checkpoint in ages. Ah, we made it through. <laughs> and there we go. And we got ourselves at a checkpoint. Thanks for the uh, donation, dragon. Uh, Says, thanks for all your videos. You are very welcome. Thanks for watching them. Okay, I see why they gave us the uh, the checkpoint there. God, that, this is an intense level. This is a really good level, though. It's really nice just playing, like, a, just a good Mario level. Like, so many of, like, the... Le oh, hello. Uh, so many of the levels are just, like, these weird gimmicks, which are, like, cool to see, but not necessarily, like, fun to play. But this is, like, actually just really fun to, to play. Uh, right. I couldn't quite work out what I... Uh, what I had to, to do there. So jump over you. I don't know if I need to like hit that question block. I don't know if that does anything. 
Uh, can I play your course? Uh, yeah, probably a little bit later on. Uh, I'll play people's courses. So not yet. I'm just gonna like sample what's going on with like the the most popular courses, and then maybe um a little bit later on in the the stream, we're we're kind of just start playing other people's courses. I I feel like this is getting to the point where like the more I replay a section, like I gradually get worse. <laughs> I gradually get worse and worse at it. I think that was a, a perfect example of that. <laughs> Have you noticed that on like the hook thing, there's like a little face? <laughs> I don't know if it's actually meant to be a face or like bolts or something. But you see like the grabber thing. There's like a little just face on it. Like when she's- Oh! Oh it is a face! When, when it grabs you it goes like- <laughs> Go fast. Okay, I'll try and go- I'll try going fast. Went too fast. You actually have quite a lot of time. It's just the the like my first time doing this bit. I just got to that ending section. I just wasn't sure sure where to go next. Like I did this bit first time. It is the case where like you do it first time and you're all right, and then you just gradually get worse and worse. There we go. And then I just need to jump immediately. No, I need to just jump to the right immediately. Then just jump up and then get grabbed again. I think. So let's go here, take my time, jump. Then I need to go dirt, dirt, just jump up. And then, okay, I just need to jump like straight up and then get grabbed again. Uh, will you play Super Mario Galaxy? Uh, probably not, just because it's like, it's only on the uh, the Wii. There's no real like, like well, I haven't got a Wii <laughs> for stars. I don't really have like a, a good way to, to record the, the Wii. Okay, that's what I need to do. I just need to jump and throw it and then just land on that platform on the right. Okay. I've worked out what I need to do on that bit now. Hello from Sweden. Hello. Right, this is the bit. I need to go. <gasps> okay, <laughs> that was good. Oh, then, oh, then I need to ride it back up. I think. Okay, then I get rid of this, and then okay, they've got like nice friendly arrows, but I know this guy's gonna chase me when I get to here. Ooh, ooh, okay. <laughs> that was a little bit terrifying. Like it was extra scary because I made it through that difficult bit. And I just didn't want to fail the next bit. Uh, hello from Norway, says who knows. God, I thought it was uh, was cold here at the moment. I bet it's very cold in Norway for you right now. <laughs> that was a great level. Uh, what are you playing? Uh, this is Super Mario Maker 2. It is the second Super Mario Maker. Uh, beginner Hero Trainer. God, like a lot of people have played this one. It's got a very high clear rate. Let's do this one. Let's switch things around. Let's do a bit of, a, of an easier level for this next one. <laughs> Ah, it's a Zelda level. So does that actually like attack? If I hit someone with a sword, does it actually attack? Oh, it does! It's got the music as well. Actually, I won't sing it because the timing's probably like slightly off and it's really annoying. Oh, can I do like a, oh, I can do, like, a little ground pound? <laughs> oh, that was really satisfying. They're just like master swords popping out of every pipe. Can I like... Did, 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 yep. Yeah. <laughs> right, if I just run, can I like... Did, 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 okay, I can. <laughs> that was cool, the way they did that music. And then Zelda needs to go down the mirror. It's actually a little bit like uh, Link's Awakening. Because Link's Awakening was kind of like uh, a bit of like a, a Zelda and Mario crossover. It's like a Zelda game with like loads of Mario stuff in it. Can I like... Di -di 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 okay, no. I cannot use my sword. <laughs> Can I like lure him forward and then run? Nope, I just got to go... Whee! Okay. That didn't work very well. I'm meant to do this bit. 
I don't think I can. I don't think I can make that jump round. Do I just not need to be Zelda for the next bit? Oh, may I think maybe I just need to to get him to get hit, and then while he's going back, if I go now, oh, it's too slow. But yeah, I think that's what I need to do. I just need to do a loop around. It's just kind of tricky lining up this next jump because I'm so slidey and it's so thin. I think I need to do this, and there we go. I can jump up. So I think no matter what, I'm gonna get hit here unless I can hit these with my sword. I cannot. So I think I just need to let myself get hit once. And then I can get up to the, the top. And they're going to give me another sword, I reckon. Are you going to give me a sword? Nope, no swords. There we are. There's my sword. This next part, I should just be able to like, run under it, I think. And then... Hmm. Oh, do I ground pound here? No. What am I doing this way? I don't know. Oh, press down, people are saying. Oh, press down to use your shield. Oh! Oh, that's cool. Thanks for the, the help, guys. Use your shield. Shield, shield, shield. Okay. I didn't know. I didn't know you had to press down. Now I know. This is cool though, like it actually just feels like I am just playing Zelda. Right, now I guess we do this side, which is like the, the little bomb level. Shout out to, uh, oh, Galaxy Wolfie again. Says, I don't know why I'm wasting my money on your donation. Save your money! Oh, 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 saying press up and Y. Ah! Okay, they like really added loads of the uh, the Zelda mechanics in. Do I just have to like stand up here and do it? Hold up a more, I can see everyone saying it now. <laughs> yeah, I didn't realize they were showing me on the uh, like in the ice. Can I not be uh, jumping and doing it? Hmm. Looks like I can't do it while jumping. Do I just need to like... No, won't let me do it there. Hmm. What do I do this bit? Uh, oh, use bow. Oh. God, it's kind of quite hard to time it. There we go. Thanks for the help, guys. What else can I do? I can like probably like aim it around. All right, I reckon that's what I need to do. I just need to do it quicker. I and mean, this is a bit fancy, isn't it? Right, I think I do have like one more of these to do before I get the uh, the key. Oh, so this one's meant to be all about the the bow. This is cool. It's actually really fun. Right, where's the uh? Where's the switch? Right, see if I can work this one out. Oh, do I do a bomb here? Is this gonna blow up? There's one little mischievous block <laughs> down there. I don't know if I can make, oh. I could do like a proper charge. Right, what am I missing? Okay, I kind of accidentally got the bomb where I needed it. Oh, that was what I was meant to do. Can I then, like, can I ground pound down here? Uh, do I do a bomb there again? Uh, use the bow. Shoot towards the coins. Oh, really? Oh, is it gonna, like, does it go actually proper physics? 
Oh, it's gonna probably like drop down. That's cool. Right, uh, I guess it needs to be like right back here. This is smart. I'm not smart, but this is smart. How many of you that are like telling me what to do have played the level yourselves and how many of you are just smarter than me? <laughs> we did it. We made it through. We made it through in the, the end. Is this going to be a helmet? It is. <laughs> Just smarter, everyone's saying. <laughs> right, is the big showdown then against Bowser. Can I just stand up here and spam arrows? Or do I need to hit the uh, that P switch? Hey, that was cool. It's cool that it was like a, a puzzle rather than just like just having to shoot him again and again and again. See, I can be smart too. <laughs> I could have done the uh, the P switch to get to the top. Uh, how long have you been streaming for? Uh, not too long. Uh, we're like half an hour in. Oh, what's the green thing? That's Bowser. You never seen Bowser before? Hi, Stampy. Uh, says play pretend. Hello, welcome. Uh, can someone explain to me what's happening? I just joined. I'm just playing through some uh, some Mario Maker levels just for a bit of fun. Uh, oh, let's do it. Let's do a level for my mum. This is by Harry. Let's see the the level uh, level Harry made for uh, for his mum. Apparently, it's short and sweet. Oh, they just made it like very, very clear. Oh, what's down this one? Hmm. <laughs> Oh, that was mean. That piranha plant jumping out. I think maybe they've made it for their mum who might not play many video games. They're just making it uh, quite easy for them. Oh, was that saying like what button to press? Oh, it's Bowser. Is it going to be embarrassing if uh, Harry's mum was able to complete the level, but I wasn't? <laughs> oh, hello. Okay. This has uh, got a little bit uh, <laughs> a little bit more fiery all of a sudden. Is this a bit of a cheating stra strategy? Like, there's no way I can die. It's like, like I'm in like a shower of fire flowers here. <laughs> all right, let's get out of here. You uh rock love heart. That was cute. Oh, look at that. I love you. That is so wholesome and adorable. <laughs> uh, how are you doing, Stampy? Uh says got a uh, Tron. I'm doing good. I'm not doing bad, thank you very much. It's very cold and dark outside. Took Alex out for a walk, which wasn't a um wasn't particularly pleasant, I don't think, for, for me or the, the dog. But back home in the, the warmth now. Logical Linking Cave 18. Oh, are we on an auto-scroller? Ah, oh, okay, it's another uh, another Zelda one. I've not played any of these Zelda ones, this is cool. Okay, so I've, I've learned some more of the uh, the mechanics. How do I do the bombs? Down and Y, no? Oh, up and Y, that was it. Yes, yeah, so I've started learning some more of the, the mechanics. So hopefully I'll be a little bit less lost this time than I was last time. Maybe. <laughs> oh yeah, so I need to blow up here, I guess. Ooh. Oh, the vine's making it so I can't um, do a bomb very easily.
Then I need to... Oh, no. Let me do that. I need to shoot up here. I guess that little line showing me where to stand. And that gets me a spring. I should be able to bounce my way out of here. It's quite a lot of, like, weird controls to remember for these Zelda levels. <laughs> kind of like, I was really trying to shoot an arrow at it, but I thought, like, oh yeah, I can just, I can just bang my head on it. <laughs> the old-fashioned way. Right. Am I going to be able to hit an arrow at that guy? I don't think I am. So I've seen you make a, a block appear here so I can get through the door. Hmm. So I can't... Oh, there we go. I was able to hit an arrow on that one. So I can't jump and do bombs. I need to be standing, like, on the ground, which is kind of one of the, uh, the things I need to get my head around. Aha! So that's got me a spring. How do I get up there? Is something going to change after this finishes, or can I make that jump? That might be doable, you know. Ooh, just about. Right, now I've got a spring. Okay, that's going to take me up to here. And then, ah, is that going to make the block just spawn? And then that's going to get me the next... Oh, this is, this is like, too clever for me. This is too clever for me. I'm low battery, gotta go. See you later! <laughs> Sorry, go charge your phone! <laughs> Okay, we've got ourselves a checkpoint. There's nothing really too dangerous in this level, to be fair. It's just like the, the puzzles. Uh, do I shoot an arrow through here? Ooh, that was close. Nailed it. Right, now what? There's two doors here. I think maybe when this uh, the music ends, something's going to happen. Or maybe not. Anything else I can shoot? Maybe a bomb? Ah, that's going to blow up that block, then they're going to drop down. Okay, we got one spring. Oh, this level's so smart, isn't it? Oh, what did that get me? Oh, so that just takes me out of there. Hmm. So do I need to get through the door on the, the left? Can I move the spring? Okay, I can't pick up the spring at all because it's like old Mario. I don't think there's anything else I can really shoot. All right, I've got to work this out. There's nothing I can really do from here. And that just jumps me straight back down. Hmm. Might be a little bit stuck here. I also, there's that ice right at the bottom right. I obviously need to somehow blow that up. I just have no idea how I'd get a bomb over there. So I don't got any ideas. Uh, are you playing viewer levels? Uh, not now. This is like a, a normal one. But I might do some uh, some viewer viewer levels later. I might need some help in this guy. Does anyone, anyone know what I should do? And uh, maybe check another bomb in the, the hole. Or like over this way. I mean, oh, that's going to switch the red back on. If I do it again, is it going to give me the other spring? Oh, now it's opened up. Now I should be able to hit that other bomb down there. Just got to get it right over to the side. There we go. Now that's going to send the other spring up here. And then that's going to get me through the pipe. We got there. We got there in the end. A lot of people saying, I have no clue. <laughs> Is it going to let me hit that? That P switch? There we go. And then now I should be able to hit the uh, these guys on the other side. These controls, they are a little bit, a little bit fiddly. Like, once you start pulling out the bow... You can't change, like, the direction you're aiming in. It does definitely feel like it's, like, Zelda added into a, a Mario game rather than just feeling like a Zelda game. <laughs> I 
know if I stand here. There we go. We got there in the end. Well, that's going to bounce me up to here. I'm assuming I'm going to have to... I don't know why, but I'm assuming I'm going to have to shoot that for some reason. <laughs> so let's, let's just shoot it. Get ahead of the game. Oh, I've got some coins. Okay, that just loops me back around to there. I can drop down here again. And hit this P-switch. Okay, let's put me back up to here. And then, okay, then I need to loop around again. Because those P's, these are going to disappear. And then I can go through the door, right? Hey, this level's awesome. We're not done yet. Oh, I think if I do a bomb down here to get the power block, that's going to drop this down for me here. And I'll be able to get past. Oh, no, did it not? Did it not do it? Oh, I'm running out of time here. Being too slow. Oh, that's not blowing up that power block. Can I, do you reckon I, can I shoot an arrow down there? I can. Okay, that's how I get through here. And now, didn't mean to get a bomb. Now I climb up here. And that's got me the spray. I've got to be quick here. I've got 70 seconds left. Oh, that just... That all came down just to move the spring across. That was really smart. Right, I'm doing good here, but I haven't had a checkpoint in so long. I'm getting worried just because I'm running out of time. Oh, I think, do I just use a jump and fire it across? How do I hit it? Do I have to use a bomb? Ah, the bomb, not the arrow. That's going to drop me down. 50 seconds. Oh, that was it! Woo! That was, a. Uh... <laughs> that was close. Uh, I'm not playing user levels yet. I probably will a little bit later on in the, the stream. But I always like to, to start off by just kind of seeing, um, like, the like the top ones of the, the day. Let's do a Christmas one. We wish you a Merry Christmas. Oh, this is a music one. Let me uh, let me turn the, the sound up a bit for you. Oh, I failed. <laughs> Let's try that again, shall we? Only I can fail on the levels that you're not meant to fail at. So cute! Well, if that didn't get you all in the Christmas spirit, I don't know what will. I love the way, like, it didn't need to, but, like, the level looks so nice as well. And at the end of there, it says, Merry Christmas. <laughs> Please don't uh, encourage people to spam, Gregor. You should do a live stream opening your, your gifts. <laughs> I will not be a live streaming on Christmas Day, I'm afraid to, to say. Uh, let's do crazy jumps. This has got like a, a slightly less than a 4% win rate. So this one might be a bit of a tricky one. Uh, why are you streaming so much, says Hylia. Uh, it's fun. I enjoy doing it. Might as well make the uh, the most of being able to to stream with a live chat uh, before Copper comes in in January and uh, takes away the the chat. Ooh, oh no no no! Oh! <laughs> I thought I was messing it up. I thought I couldn't get through the pipe, but I think the pipe's just literally blocked, and there's no way to get through the pipe. <laughs> And that's why it was laughing at me. I thought I messed it up and I thought I'd failed, but no, I think you just can't get through the pipe. You just need to wait for the platform to drop. Yeah, I think I just need to go down this way. And then, okay, okay. Just need to take my time a little bit more there. 
Stampy now shows his hardcore parkour skills. <laughs> oh yeah, there we go. There, there's a great example of my hardcore parkour skills. <laughs> Come on, I got this. I got this. This is it. It's actually, it looks, I think, way more difficult than it does. I probably shouldn't say that because I'm going to jinx it and then fail, but... Those bits, like, it's it's scary because you're so close to, like, the, the blades every time. But that first bit, at least, actually wasn't too difficult. God, that jump's a bit... A bit difficult. Like, I don't know, should I jump sooner? Or, like, run to the right more? Let's just jump... Okay, I think I just need to jump, like, immediately when I land. Stampy, you're streaming too much, says Helen. Yeah, I mean, you don't have to watch. <laughs> like, if you don't watch the streams, it's exactly the same as me not streaming. <laughs> he looks so focused, do I? Is this, my, is this my focused face? Oh, God, this is scary. The difficult ones aren't like the long jumps. It's when you need to either not jump or do like a little tiny jump or guide your way through the air like that. Oh, this is terrifying. Terrifying. Oh, no, I think that was the last one. That was the last one. <laughs> okay. I, I got to learn, like, the layout of the level a little bit there. Ooh. Steady on. Steady on. Steady. Right, this is coming up to where I messed up last time. Nope. Messed up again. Even worse. Happy Tuesday. <laughs> Happy Tuesday. <laughs> Yeah, there's like loads of tiny jumps that you need to do in this one, which is a little bit more tricky. Because the instinct is to like just jump, like full jump every time. It's actually harder to do like the, the little tiny jumps or when you just got to drop down like that. So I have to do, I think it's here I have to drop down again. That one's a bit tricky. Then I guess I drop down here. Oh, oh no, we're going back the whole way again. These are some crazy jobs. Okay, I made it. Checkpoint? Okay, we've got a checkpoint. Good. I don't care. I don't care if I failed. As long as I get the checkpoint, I'm happy. Right, let's see if I can do this like first go. Or like first second go. <laughs> or second go, as it's commonly known. Okay, I failed. Right, let's see if I can do this on my first third attempt. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let's see if I can do this on my first fourth attempt. This is going to be the first time I've ever tried this level the fourth time. Okay, this one seems like confusingly easy, that bit. Oh, that's the end of the level. Okay, that was like way not too bad. Uh, why you barely post, says Maddox. Uh, I'm just not doing many videos at the, the moment. I'm enjoying the live streams too much, to be honest. Just enjoying doing these. I know that for those of you that want me to do more Lovely World or do more Terraria and stuff, I know it's a shame, but like if I'm not looking forward to doing it and enjoying doing it, like the videos will just be rubbish anyway. Uh, right then, uh, infinite checkpoints and six rooms control your jumps in most rooms. This is called Relaxing Red Coins 3. Right, let's have a, a relaxing level after that last one then, shall we? <laughs> uh... Okay, I see. Ooh. I think I need to jump sooner to get like a uh, a little bit more of the uh, the momentum. Exactly how I didn't do then. Emerald Stars is how you go so good at this game. That's a bad time for you to leave that comment as I keep repeatedly failing. <laughs> maybe, maybe I don't need to, maybe I need to jump when it's just right at the, the top then. I thought like jumping earlier to keep more momentum would work, but it doesn't seem to. Alright, let's just jump when it's right at the top. There we go. Ooh. God, that one's so tough! Then I need to land on the Goombas and then get to the next level. They called this level relaxing. This is not relaxing. I think always jumping when it's starting to go down seems to be working easier. I seem to be jumping higher.
There we go. Ooh! This is not relax. Why did they title this relaxing? This is the opposite of relaxing. <laughs> I can feel my heart race increasing with every jump. Right, so I think there's now like four rooms that I can go through in like any order. Okay, so I think I just need to time it. So when it's down, then I get to the, the next one. So I guess if, if I jump while it's going up, so if I go now, okay, oh, but then where do I go? I assume there'd be like something for me to jump up to at the, the top up there. Where do I go in that one? Oh, do I, oh, do I need to like knock the underneath of it? Ah, okay. Oh, I gotcha. Okay, I was like making it like more difficult for myself than it needed to be. Right, I need to do this jump first go because the Gomba's gonna get taken out. Oh no. To be fair, I don't think there was gonna be any way for me to complete that one. Can we see Beth? <laughs> we just bring her in and like put her on display. <laughs> Ooh, ooh, okay. I don't want to like hit the top. Am I okay to get past here? Right, let's put the vines down there. No! I need a jump when I'm lower on that next bit. This is this is meant to be a relaxing level. So I think I do get a new checkpoint after every single one of these levels I complete. Like I don't know whether this is like a difficult one or whether the other ones are going to be more difficult. Let's just assume we've started off with the uh, the most difficult one. Oh, I didn't get the uh, the vine out. Stampy now has our beard. Uh, how's Alex? She is good. She's been really tied out recently. We had like a... Uh, our friend's got a, a puppy. Who's a Rottweiler cross collie. And they were over for the weekend. And they like played like all weekend with each other. And Alex has just been like exhausted since because they were like endlessly playing. Like they'll take turns, like they'll be playing for ages. Then one would get tired and try and settle down. Then the other one would wake up and want to play. And then they just like took it in turns, like wanting to play. So they basically just had like no break the entire weekend. She had a great time, but now she's exhausted. No. Okay, I think I need to. Oh, I won't even let me go back through the door. I think I just need to reset. Let me just try one of the uh, the other the other doors for a chain. See whether they're, they're all going to be this difficult. Uh, Crimson Flash says, so Stampy, are you doing anything special for Christmas? Uh, no. Uh, just going to go uh, over to my parents. All my uh, family are going to be uh, coming down. So, yeah, we're just probably going to play some games. Eat a whole lot of food. Kind of standard traditional Christmas. Uh, are you going to get Overwatch 2? Uh, probably. Like, there's not even like a release date or anything yet, but... Uh, I'll probably end up getting it. Like, I'm not really excited about it, but um, I'll probably end up playing it at some point. Uh, do you have a Wii U? I do. It is sitting in a box <laughs> in the attic. Uh, but I do I do own one. Like, since I got the Switch, I haven't gone back to the, the Wii U at all. Doesn't mean, like, much reason to. Like, the one game that would have made me want to go back to playing the, the Wii U would have been, like, Super Mario Maker. And now there's like Super Mario Maker 2, which is pretty much better in every way. Like there's been like no real reason to go back to the Wii U. So this is tricky because you got it like the jumps are pretty easy to jump over it. But if you go too high, you get stuck in that like little room up there. So you've got to like jump right to the, like the limit of your jump but without going over. And then either you go too high or you get uh, eaten. Watching this is pretty frustrating, not gonna lie. Think about what it's like playing it. <laughs> I can uh, switch levels. If uh, yeah, all these rooms seem to be this hard, I might switch to play a, a different one. Uh, now what do I do? Oh, I've got to jump in the Goomba. 
Oh dear. Oh, that was scary. Okay. Uh, I need to just get you to... No! I'm done. Rage quit. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, that was so tough. Hi, Aiden! Uh, stayed at home to play World of Tanks and watch the, the stream. Thanks for the, uh, the donation. Enjoy World of Tanks. The Lost City of Shangri-La. This might be a, a nice, a nice change of tempo. Uh, make a level on stream. I, I can't build any levels just because for you to see it on the stream, it needs to be in the dock. And to make a level, I need to use touch screen. Like, otherwise I've got to use the analog stick and it's just really slow and like really frustrating. So I would love to make a level with stream and like take your suggestions and stuff. But um, yeah, I just can't really... Uh, like you wouldn't be able to see the screen like unless I like held it up to like the webcam like there's no real way for me to do that I'm afraid this is a pretty level it doesn't seem like punishingly difficult either <laughs> which is a nice change am I going the right way I don't think so Do I go up to the top now? Uh, you should play Undertale one day. Uh, I've played Undertale. I've already played it. So confused about which way to go. <laughs> like normally on Mario, it's like there's very obvious which way you're meant to be going. This level's like so open. There's like so many different like routes and stuff that I could go on. And that was not the the right one. That was a spike. Uh, any games you recommend for the the Switch? Um, like I mean Mario Maker. Like this is one of the best games. If you haven't played Zelda Breath of the Wild yet, then like absolutely get that. Uh, Mario Party and Mario Kart are like good party games. Uh, there's a game called Tricky Towers, uh, which I did one video on, but we play that all of the time still. We played that on the, the weekend as well, actually. So if you have not played Tricky Towers, it's kind of like, it's a bit like Tetris, but just a bit more crazy and silly with power-ups and stuff. So uh, yeah, definitely recommend playing that game. Uh, Untitled Goose Games on the, the Switch is also on a... Uh, or coming to PS4 as well. Am I meant to like go over here? Where am I meant to go from this bit? So that shoots down some vines. I don't think that like actually does anything. Uh, thank you uh, AJ Dixon for the... Uh for the donation. It says, I've been watching you since the beginning of your lovely world and I've been hooked since. Uh, also, uh, when will you go back uh, and look at building time world with uh, with Squid? So, uh, I don't know if this is what you're referring to, uh, but the other day I did a, a stream with Squid and we ended up loading up the uh, the old quest world and having a tour around that. And a lot of people said about um, touring building timer as well. And so I said that we'd probably do that at some point. So, we'll probably do like either a stream or a video where we're going like tour like, just go look at our, all our old builds and stuff. I think it would be quite fun. I don't know when, but just, yeah, maybe whenever we're both free. Probably before Christmas. Am I just meant to jump and land on those vines? Love the visit to the uh, the quest world, says Stargaze. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Like, that wasn't meant... Like, it's always fun, like, when it's you end up doing something you weren't meant to do. Like, we, w we were just going to play the battle mini game, But then it, it ended up everyone kept lagging out and stuff. It, it just wasn't working. We had a bunch of tech problems with uh, getting that working. And so, kind of as, like, a last resort, because I was worried everyone was going to be bored, I thought I'd load up the, the quest world. And then uh, we checked it out, and it was a lot of fun. So am I meant to just go and, like, get onto these vines here? Ah, I am. Okay, I was just going completely the wrong way. 
You know what I was saying about how there's like so many different ways I could go on this uh, this level? I was picking the wrong one. Uh, play Super Mario Odyssey. Uh, I've already completed it. Uh, I did a, a full Let's Play through, so if you want to see me play it. Uh, yeah, I've played the uh, the entire game already. Uh, the only one I didn't play in videos was like the uh, like the Dark Side of the Moon levels. But uh, yeah, the actual like main story, I played through the uh, the whole thing. Uh, what's your favorite Nintendo Switch game? Uh, it's got to be Breath of the Wild. Just because, like, Breath of the Wild is, like, one of my just favourite games just of all time anyway. Like, Switch or not. Uh, oh, do I need to go and set it red again? Where do I go? I, do I have to just go down now? Oh, I do. I do. Okay, I think I need to find another switch. Ah, oh, now I can get the P switch and go down here. Oh, hello! Oh, dear. Oh, no, thank you. Oh, dear. Oh, no! Oh, was that me dead? Oh, I didn't realize that was like the bottom of the, the level there. Uh, Eve says, uh, would you ever do a Mario Kart race with fans? That could be cool. I wonder how easy that would be to, to set up to, to play with fans. I'm not the best at Mario Kart. I'm alright. I'm alright at Mario Kart. I'm not the, the best. That could be a fun thing to, to do though. I wonder like how like um, easily I could set up a game that everyone can join. Like would you need to be like my friend on Switch to join or could like anyone search and join? Like I wonder how easily that would work. But if that's something that I could set up then that could, uh, that could be good fun. Okay, so that's what I needed to do. Oh, let's wait for these to pass. I'm a little older. It's going to sound a little bit scared because I don't have a mushroom. Not that it <laughs> not that it mattered too much. Loads of people fell down there. Uh, thanks for the uh, donation, Kevin. like I'm failing a lot in this level like it's not making me angry I think it's because it's just so obviously me <laughs> playing bad that's making it fail like sometimes the level is just like devious and you fail because of that and sometimes you're just like yeah I'm just not doing very good <laughs> my bad <laughs> but jumping across these vines can be awkward especially with, like the uh, the bouncy blocks at the top let's just take it super slow and just go one at a time Just crouch under this guy. Ooh! Ooh, 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 I'm right on the edge. There we go. Okay. <laughs> no, I, I honestly just thought it was just going to dunk me off the, the edge then. Oh, this is back to where I was earlier. This is where I was like struggling, but I couldn't get to this bit area, uh, this area here earlier. But this is this is where I was. Oh, this is going to be, like, right back at the, the beginning now. This is so cool. Now I go up here. I guess up this way, maybe? Ooh, dip. Okay, that, that side's blocked off now. And now I'm going back the other way. Oh, this is such a cool level. Oh, no! <laughs> I just saw them, like, as I was landing. Ah, oh, sent me so far back as well. I'm determined to finish this level now, though. It's not too difficult. And now I kind of know what's coming up a little bit better. I just want to make sure I don't get hit at least once. Please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. Ooh. Ooh, no. No, Goomba. Goomba, no. No, I got hit. I was, I, oh, the Goomba wasn't going to jump across. I was like, I'm going to get hit by that or the Goomba. Okay, i got to be really careful. Now, at least I don't need to crouch for this bit. <laughs> and just go underneath it.
Okay, we got ourselves a mushroom again. We are good. Alright, we're almost back to where we failed last time. Let's be super careful this time. Alright, this guy hit me last time. That's what I've got to watch out for. Can I go to you? You and I know they're going to be here as I land. I was ready for you this time, Goomba. Oh, checkpoint! Glorious checkpoint! Ah, oh, so satisfying. Thank you, uh, Fiery? Uh, for I would ask, uh, how will you, uh, combat Copper? Uh, I don't really know yet. Uh, we'll, we'll have to see how it affects me. Uh, I think that if, like, um... Like, my channel gets, like, deemed by them to being directed at kids rather than, like, directed at, like, mixed audience, I guess. People of, like, different ages. Then, uh, yeah, it'll basically stop me doing YouTube. Just because at the moment, like, the main thing I'm doing on YouTube is live streams. And if, like, there's no, uh, like, it turns the chat off. So it's not even, like, it's not the, the monetation, um, like, the, the, like, the advert side of it that's gonna, like, really mess me up. It's just the fact they would turn live chat off and, like, who wants to, like, watch a live stream without live chat? That's, like, one of the points of it. There's like these arrows here. What am I? What am I meant to be doing here? Oh, do I have to like shoot fireballs down there? Oh dear. Hopefully not. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, do I need to get uh, them to shoot into them? Oh, oh, it's just shoot. I think I just had to like survive. Okay, I was like, they're like really trying to work out what I needed to do. I think I just needed to wait. I needed to be patient. It's cool, you keep going back to, like, areas that, like, look almost the same as areas that you've done before, but they're just, like, all slightly different. Oh, but there we go! We have completed the, the level, I believe. We have! We've made our way to the end. Now, that level was awesome! I'm glad I uh, stuck with that one. Uh, April says, props for being so kind to everyone. Thank you, April. And thank you for being kind for the donation and uh, watching the, the stream. Uh, oh, David said, here's a cat-related level when you decide to play viewer levels. And then they've sent the, the ID. That was from David. Okay. Should we do some? Uh, should we do some viewer levels now then? Uh, thank you also for uh, the donation from uh, Loki Returns, uh, a, uh, a long time viewer of the the channel and the the streams. Thank you so much, uh, Samzi uh, as well. Uh, you were in Gamer's Guide to Everything. I was in Gamer's Guide to Everything. That was a, a long time ago. Right then, how did I search for courses again? Do I do like detailed search? Uh, the search feature has been improved. You can now run advanced searches. Okay. How do I do it just by the code? Oh, did I just do ID here, I think? Okay, let's start off with this, uh, this cat-themed level from, uh, from David then. Uh, you'll see the, um, uh, the code on screen. If you want to, um, if you want to play one of these levels uh, as well yourself, uh, then yeah, feel free. Uh, it would be sad to see a childhood uh, YouTuber leave. I know, it would be unfortunate. But, like, I feel that even if, like, this copper goes through, uh, as the way it seems like it will, um, I feel like it won't last. I feel like it will end up being changed in a few months or so. Like, so even if it does seem like end of the world come January, I, like, I, I genuinely feel like it will uh, it will switch it around. Anyway, Mario's Cat Astrostof... As I think it's like cat... I can't even say it. Well, how, I can't say it. Cata I think it's like catastrophe... That's it. Catastrophe. I struggle pronouncing that word. <laughs> I got there. I got there in the end. If you have no idea what I'm on about, by the way, with this copper stuff, I uploaded a video kind of talking about it on my second channel, if you are confused. Uh, but basically, some changes coming to, to YouTube in the, the new year, which uh, some parts of it are good. Uh, a lot of it uh, isn't going to be great for, for people that do uh, kid videos. Oh, that was super close. <laughs> Right, I'm assuming I'm going to be getting one of the uh, the cat suits at some point. Hello! Oh, the big fellow to... <laughs> okay, or do, I, do I choose? Uh, this one. Oh, no. I think I need to get the, the key first. Do I, need to, do I need to kill him to get the key? Oh, he's always oh, invisible. That's not fair. Oh, you can kind of like just about see where he is. All right, let's wait for him to spin up again. Because then he's going slow. Okay, I got one of the keys. Uh, right, I got to pick. Left or right, guys? We're gonna have a vote in the the chat. 
left or right, I'm going to do the, the one that you suggest. And then that means if it's something really bad, I can blame all of you and it won't be my fault. But if it's good, you get all of the credit as well. <laughs> uh, oh, most people seem to be saying left at the beginning. Yeah, there seems to be a slight majority. There's a big majority in left. Right, left it is, chat. You have made the, the decision. And it got me killed. Are you happy with yourself? Are you, are you proud of yourself? This is where everyone says, like, no, I meant right. <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot about these guys. Oh, dear. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, no. Don't, don't. Please don't. Please don't blow me up. What, should, what happens if I just keep going? Should I just keep going this way? Let's, uh, let's just ignore that whole area. Oh, can I not go through this pipe? Oh, this is giving me the uh, the cat uniform. And now I can climb up here. Okay, maybe I didn't even need to like defeat that boss. Oh, is that just for a bonus point? Oh, okay, I think we uh, we do need uh, to go back. Oh, and I immediately lose the, uh, the cat uniform. Oh yeah, did I have to go through that door? Was that where I was meant to go? Am I am I playing your your level well, David? <laughs> am I doing good? Is this the way you intended for it to be played? Oh, they don't seem to be turning invisible this time. Oh dear, but they got me. Now they're turning invisible. Okay, left or right? Should we go left or right this time? Should we go? Should we try left again and see if it will work this time? Yeah, should we try left? Only joking. Only joking. Let's go right. Please don't kill me. Okay, we're good. Three doors. Oh, I think I need the keys for them. Uh, thank you, Luke, for the uh, the donation. Uh, Stampy, could you please help me on uh, on Minecraft? Uh, sadly, uh, I probably wouldn't be much help on Minecraft anyway, but uh, I'm doing Mario Maker at the, the moment. All right, straight into another boss fight. Right, at least they're giving us a fire flower this time. If I stay here and dodge as best I can... Then if I do get hit, then at least I'll be like right on the uh, the fire flower. Like it will just drop on my head and I'll be able to survive. Let me just see what's going on over this side. Okay, cheeky coin. I don't think I can do anything while they're at the, the back of the stage like that. I think I just need to, to wait for them to, to return. I might try uh, jumping on their head. I don't think the, uh, the fire flowers do too much damage against the bosses. Oh, it hit me. I don't know if I can even jump on its head. It's like, it's too big. <laughs> they all have to, to keep spamming the, the fire flowers. Ooh, dear. Ooh, no. I don't like not being near my, my little fire flower respawn pipe. <laughs> I'm going to actually play smart and try and avoid the, uh, the fire. Okay, let's get back over to the left. <laughs> okay, if I stand here, then even if I get hit... I should be okay. Oh, I think I got him. I got him. Okay. That didn't take as long as I thought it would do. Right, I got a key. But where's the door? Where do I go from here? There's not an invisible block, is there? Oh, oh, okay. There's an invisible cat block here. I mean, lucky I just randomly started jumping around the place. Oh, the coins indicate hidden power-ups. Okay. Oh, I need to be careful because I can't... I, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get out again now. So I think I'm meant to use the uh, to be the cat to get out. But because this is the pipe that drops fire flowers down, <laughs> it's kind of hard to to avoid them. Like, what do you do at this point? Like, am I? I, th I think I'm just like dead. I think I just need to restart the level. Unless there's like another hidden cat like up here somewhere. No, I, th I think this is it. I think this is like it's called like a soft lock. Where, like, the game, like, you can't complete it, but you're, like, you're not dead. <laughs> it's it's kind of worse. Like, if I was taking it out, at least I'd restart. I think I'm just kind of stuck here. <laughs> it's a cool level, though. I mean, it just gets, like, bonus points for just being, like, uh, like cat-themed <laughs> as well. <laughs> I'll donate you a thousand dollars if you play Fortnite, no joke. <laughs> yeah. I don't really believe that. Uh, right then, should we play another level? There was a, um... 
A donation that we had come through earlier from Pickle on a String, asking if we can play their course. So let's uh, let's play their course, and then we'll have a look at the the chat and to see if there's uh, any other uh, course suggestions. So this one is P one L uh, Y ninety. Why not? Uh, and then F Y G. All right, let's see a uh, pickle on a strings level then. Uh, Sixty-two percent clear rate, so it shouldn't be too uh, <laughs> too difficult. But I'm kind of a little bit scared saying that, just in case um I end up really failing, and I say that I should have been easy. Ooh, oh dear, oh dear. Okay, certainly not going to be easy. But hopefully it will be doable. And doable by me as well. Oh hello. Swamps and clown cars is not something you want to face. Okay. It was a little level. It was a little level. That was a cool level, though. It was tricky. Oh, yeah. oh dear. It's kind of not nice to play a shorter one, to be fair. <laughs> Stupid Vegan says, I actually love you so much. <laughs> I love the uh, the username Stupid Vegan. <laughs> I'm either one or both of those things, so... Uh... <laughs> Hopefully it's the second. Right, let's do another level then. Let's do a Bumper uh, Bonanza. Uh, this is by Robert. Uh, I'll leave the uh, the code up on the, the stream for uh, a little bit. Uh, if you are playing through these levels uh, as well. Uh, BVF. Alright then, Robert. Let's, uh, let's see your level then. See if it's any good. Thanks for the uh, donation, Gary. Right, Bumper Benoza, we got the right level. 2% clear rate. This one might be a... Uh, this one might be a, a little bit more difficult. Oh, I see. I see, Robert. I see what kind of person you are. I see what kind of ordeal you're willing to put me through. <laughs> It's a, it would be fine. It's the it's not the bouncy bit or the spikes. It's the little ramp here which ruins your run up, and then gets your timing wrong. There we go. Right. <sighs> I'm so I'm so bad at these donuts. I'm so bad at bouncing on these donuts. <laughs> oh, I didn't even look at the spikes. <laughs> Most people are saying, you're vegan? <laughs> it's either that or I'm stupid. <laughs> As I said, or both. <laughs> right. Little job. This is what I was talking about earlier, if you were here there, when, like, the big job... Oh, the big jumps usually aren't, like, the tricky bit. It's, like, the... The really, like, tiny jumps where you need to not jump too high! <laughs> They're the tricky ones. This is a cool concept for a, a level, though, Robert. I'm trying to really take my time on it. Okay, looks like I need a big jump to get to that claw. <gasps> okay, oh no! Whoa, what was that? That wasn't fair! That wasn't fair! I think I need to, like, just pinball bedoying my way down that whole bit. Alright, let's try that, uh, try that again then, shall we? So big jump to the claw, it's gonna bounce me down, and then- Oh! Oh, there's the little platform above it! Okay, that was scary. Stampy, your voice went so high-pitched. It was scared it, it was scared it? It was scary, Jordan. It was scary. This is a cool level. I think I just really like the music as well. And I know they didn't like add the music in, but like, good music adds a lot to a level. Okay, I take it back. I hate this level. <laughs> I thought I liked this level. It's hurting my thumb with the D-pad pressing the buttons. I'm trying to change direction so fast. <sighs> Let's try this again. Oh, Super King, uh, the uh, four dollar donation. Can I play your level? Uh, sure, I'll give it a go after this one if I ever get out of this bouncy chamber. Come on. Okay, okay. We made. It. It's just like those jumps. I'm so inconsistent with. I got to do so many in a row perfectly. 
Things just uh, don't go well. Oh no, now I'm gonna do it over spikes. Huh? Ooh, okay. Have I got a ch- I don't think I've got a checkpoint yet. Oh, there we go. Hmm. Hmm. What do I do on this bit? Do I- is this- ah, I think I don't even go that way. I think I just have to go down this way. I need to go down on this side, I think. Or is that just to get a bonus? Okay, that was just to get a bonus life. Of which lives mean, like, nothing in this game. Right, how am I meant to do this bit then? Do I just go really fast? I just go... <laughs> okay! <laughs> I got through the seesaw bit at least. Oh, but it wasn't wasn't anything nicer on the other side. Okay. That bit's actually not too bad. It's these that I'm going to struggle with. Just because, I'm just, as I said, I'm not, I'm, I'm really inconsistent. I always jump too late on those. Like, you have to press, so I went to go near the donut. You have to press jump, like, here. Like, way before you hit it. Like, you don't jump, like, as you're reaching it. You've got to jump, like, press, like, jump now. Like, jump, like, press jump really early. Okay. Bounce my way through. Oh no, I think I messed that up. I think as I jumped down, I had to jump up and hit that switch. Did I have to jump? I think I had to jump while falling, hit the switch, land on it again, and then jump to the left. Uh, hold the jump button the whole time on the donuts. Oh really? Ah. Right, I give that a go. That was, uh, oh that was Robert who said that suggestion. That's uh, whose level I'm playing. Thanks for the, the tip, Robert. That will hopefully make this uh, a whole bunch easier for me. I'm enjoying the level, by the way. So I just hold jump? Oh, <laughs> I should probably <laughs> aim to laugh. I just held jump and just ran. <laughs> oh, I didn't make it that time. I think I was like too fast. Hello, Amy. Thanks for, for watching the, the stream. Right, hold jump the whole time. Oh my god. That is so much easier. <laughs> Why was I not doing that the whole time? I didn't even know that. I didn't even know that. It kind of makes sense because I was like, why do they have like such like a, a tricky mechanic in Mario? That I was just doing it wrong. No! I was trying to, I was getting too excited. I was trying to rush. Uh, can you try playing Ori and the, the Blind Forest? I have already played Ori and the Blind Forest and I've actually named my cat after it. <laughs> my cat's called Ori, uh, for those of you that didn't know. And then there's the uh, the new uh, the sequel to it that's coming out next year as well, which I'm really looking forward to. But yeah, it's a great game. Pretty difficult, actually. But uh, a lot of fun. Uh, <laughs> Squid in the chat saying, is this Sonic the Hedgehog? <laughs> No, that bit, that's probably the trickiest bit. Where I gotta like jump back on it while it's falling and then uh, then jump back up again. Bring the cat to the, the camera. Uh, she's not in the, the room right now. I'd need to track her down. She's the master of like finding little hidey places to, to sleep in. <laughs> I usually don't let her in my office either because she's got a bit of a... Um, a bit of a taste for cables. <laughs> like certain types of cables she uh, she chews. And uh, as you can probably imagine, my office is absolutely full of cables. So I tend not to... Like she comes at my office every now and then and we'll sit on my lap. But 
Usually I keep her at the uh, the office, especially during a stream, because I just know she'll like she'll identify like the the cable which I'm using like the the stream to go through, and she'll like target in on it and just go straight for it. <laughs> Cats have that special knowledge of like intelligence for how to cause the most destruction possible. Ooh, ooh, that was close. No! It's hard in this next bit because when you're on the donuts, if you land on like the side bit, it like, it doesn't knock you straight up. It like knocks you to the side and makes it really difficult. But yeah, this is like, this level isn't that difficult. I'm just doing really badly at it. So I know it's, it's frustrating to, to watch someone failing at a game. I'll try, I'll try to do better. Right, full, fo full focus mode, right. Next time, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna do this. I've done this in videos as well. I'm gonna go silent. I'm gonna go just focus full on the gameplay. And I bet you I'll do better this time. Okay, not that time. I mean the time the time after that. Because I was talking that time. I mean the, the time after. This time. I mean, this time is in like the, the time coming up is the time that I mean where I'm gonna do good. Just you watch. There you go. It actually worked. <laughs> it's so, honestly, like playing when you're just like ignoring everything and only focused on the game, you play so much better than when like I'm thinking about like, what's the chat saying? Is anyone, is everyone bored? Like what's going on here? Is the webcam okay? Like it just makes you like very, very bad. <laughs> but when you can just play, you do good. And oh, I think I messed this up. I think I was meant to be uh, on that little train of donuts on the, the way up. Luckily, though, uh, I was able to get a checkpoint, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, Robert says final stretch. I think maybe if I go, like, run right to the right at the beginning bit, it's going to be easier. Uh, when did you get a, a beard? Uh, Black Friday, they were, there was a sale on them, so I thought now's the time to, to do it. I picked one up cheap. I actually inherited it as a, a family heirloom. <laughs> oh, gotta be careful because I think these can like squish you against the wall. Yeah, okay. I'm so scared now. Oh, okay. We're good. We're good. Oh, there's a ti tiny little gap at the end. Oh, I so nearly fell down as well. That would have been like the worst way to go. Right, now I just need to get to, like, the end screen. There we go. I squeezed my way through. That was a great level, Robert. Thanks for, for sending it to me. That was cool. Right then, I said I was going to play a, a super, super king's level. I don't know what it's going to, to be, but uh, I guess we're going to find out. Seven minutes. Seven minutes. I think I've set the uh, the world record for the, uh, the slowest time. See, that's what I think is unfair. Is this game keeps track of world records for, like, the fastest person. To complete the the level i think they should do the slowest person as well because otherwise it's discriminating against people who are rubbish at mario like me yeah Where, when do we get our glory for our, our slowest records anyway uh yeah this one's by super king the uh the code's up on the the screen now uh if you want to um uh, if you want to if you want to play the level uh, as well oh it's called hard why is it hard oh eight percent clear rate though that's not that's not too uh, unbearable. Like, nine, nine people have been cleared, or at least it's been cleared nine times. I don't know if that means, like, nine, nine different people. Right, let's give it a go. Uh, reach the, uh, the goal while holding a Koopa shell. Okay. Oh, hello! Found a Koopa! <laughs> oh, Super King says, good luck, Stampy. Am I gonna need it? Let's take out these Goombas and see what's in these uh, these chests here. Come on, one left. 
All right, we're gonna get a mushroom or something. Okay, we got. At least we got something good after all of that. And then I can see if there's anything down here. Oh, fire flower. Don't mind if I do. Okay, so I've got to be careful. Oh, I, I don't want to go through that anymore. Let's just keep going to the, the side. Oh, so that's where it teleported me to earlier. God, there's a, a lot of... Uh, a lot of enemies in this level, Super King, in there. You didn't... Uh, <laughs> you didn't hold back on the amount of enemies. I can't even take these guys out. Okay, I took out the uh, the wizard fellow. Sorry, I don't know the name. All right, so there's the end of the level. But I do not have the, uh, the Koopa shell. Is there another way for me to, to get it other than going through here? Well, let's go through this one. Maybe this one's going to be a bit safer. Oh, it was. Okay, and then now... I'm going to keep hold of this shell. And oh no, okay. I can still get the shell from this guy. Now go back through here. It's going to take me all the way back to the beginning though. That's okay. And oh no! We got rid of the shell! Unbelievable. Right, let's go. Oh, do I need to go? Can I go back into that room again? I don't think I can. I think the uh, the I think they're just a, a one-time thing. Let's, uh, let's start over. Let me go try going through that first teleport thing again. And let me see if there is a way to survive. Because there's a Koopa right there. I wonder if I can... Ah! Ah! Sneaky, sneaky. Oh. <laughs> the, uh, I didn't realize that the uh, the floor was ice and a little bit slippery. <laughs> uh, good luck from the island, says, uh, says Helen. Thank you very much. Don't know if you know, but I am half Irish. My mum's Irish. Let's just do this to take out all these guys. Oh, no! You can't come down. No! You don't come down here. <laughs> all right. So this is good because this one's going to take me further to the right. Oh, was one of these got a mushroom in? Yes, they do. I've got to be so careful. Like, because I don't want anything to... Oh, okay. I can get my backup shell here. No! Shell? Shell? No. I've got to chase it. Come back, shell. I need you. It's Michelle. <laughs> Because it's my shell, it's Michelle. You get it? Okay, don't worry about it. No! At the last second, I lost my shell. Michelle! <laughs> okay, I think I know what I need to, to do though this time. Like, the difficulty isn't getting through the level. It's just getting through it with the, the shell. Because every time, like, the shell hits any enemy, whatever, it takes out the enemy, but then gets rid of the, the shell as well. Does your wife know you're cheating on her with someone named Michelle, says Rocket Willing. <laughs> she does not. Don't tell her. But I need Michelle! I can't complete... My life without Michelle. All right, let's just use this to take out all the enemies. Then when it comes back, I can try and grab it. Come on, Michelle. Ooh, no. Oh, come back, Michelle. Okay, at least we can take care of these guys now. All right, I got Michelle. Come on, Michelle. <laughs> come with me, Michelle. Let's get rid of you. No, you don't. No! Oh, I didn't have a mushroom, did I? I thought, like, I could just survive it. Forget about Squashy. We have Michelle now. <laughs> Gotta get Michelle. Right, let's just throw it. Take care, take care of these guys. All right, let's go. Maybe we should do the same thing, but still get the uh, the mushroom from the... Actually, no, there's a mushroom here somewhere. Okay, so that one, that's the one with the mushroom in. So when I get out, I'll grab that mushroom, and then we'll try and take it slow. I feel like I'm trying to be too speedy, and it's just making me mess up. I'm getting a... I'm, I'm, I'm learning a strategy now, though. That's the important thing. Let's leave that shell going just to take out, take out that guy. 
I can just do it the old-fashioned way. Right, go on, take them out. Oh, where'd the mich where'd the shell go? Ah, it's annoying. It's the thing with Mario is like once something gets off uh, like far off screen, it just like stops existing. It makes these stuff uh, a bit more tricky. You kind of got to like just follow the shell so you can see it. Got to follow Michelle. Never leave Michelle behind. Right, come here, Michelle. No! Ah! Oh! <laughs> it's so annoying because there's only those two ways to enter that area to get where the, the Coopers are. So if you like lose the shell once you get out, you just have to like restart the, the level. Oh, I'm a bit stuck here. <laughs> that guy teleported down. Uh, someone said viewer levels? Question mark. Yes, we are doing viewer levels. This is a, a level made by Super King. So basically, I need to get to the level while holding one of these shells. So completing the level would be easy. Like getting to the end wouldn't be a problem. I just keep losing the, the shells. I keep losing my shell. No! Stampy, I'll, I'll stop talking about Michelle. Space, she's behind you. Every, whenever someone says that, I just get super paranoid. <laughs> when someone says, like, something's behind you in the stream. <laughs> Okay, so let's get the uh, let's get the mushroom. Oh, oh, a Koopa! Is it like random enemies that come out of that block there? There's not always a Koopa that comes out of there, is there? So I was I could just use that shell. Might be worth investigating that. It's always like this bit's like trickier than it looks just because it's all on ice. So, right, let's get the mushroom. Then, is it always a Koopa that comes out of the. Oh, dear. Oh, let's just go. Let's try to take this super slow. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, right at the end. I think that's the way to, to go, though. Oh, hi, Squishy! Ignore what anyone says about Michelle. You're the only love of my life. You have not been replaced by someone called Michelle. Ah, so I think there is always a, a Koopa that comes out of there. Okay, so if I lose this shell, I might have a have backup. But I never want to lose Michelle. <laughs> No! No, no. Okay, so is, is that Koopa down here still going to be around? Or do they have just disappeared? No, I think they've just disappeared. Okay, so that's good. So if I don't do that, uh, knock that block up, it's okay. Mich Michelle is a babe. <laughs> oh, no! Uh, get an S uh, SNES Mini and replay the old games. Uh, we do. We actually play... Um, it's like uh, Kirby's Dream Course. It's a game that like Squashy and I play like, quite regularly. We had one evening where we just played it like the whole night. It's really, really fun. We actually did a video on it a while ago. So the one that's almost like a bit like a weird Kirby golf game. With like loads of weird power-ups power and stuff. Oh, is the shell just... Okay, I think that shell's just disappeared. Uh, let's try and get the uh, the Koopa from here. I'm just got to avoid the hammer bros. I th Oh, no. So the annoying thing is, is every time we go through, like, those teleporting cube things, it respawns all the enemies back in. Which kind of makes it, like, really tricky every time. I'm super determined to complete this level. I was so close completing it before. I just know that I can't give up. 
So there's no point taking out those wizard guys now. Just because uh, I know that they're going to be back. Oh, Squishy's, Squishy's ordered uh, ordered pizza. Michelle. <laughs> it's Michelle. I'll give her the pizza. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't even. I don't even hear us streaming. <laughs> No, the show. Okay, wait. I think it's okay. Come on, let's take out this wizard. Because the other thing's causing me pain. Then I should be able to go get the other Koopa. From here. What do you mean, Onward? That was from a donation. I'll pay you back. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, there was a, I don't know, I can't remember who it was from. Sorry if they're, if they're here. But we had a, a donation the uh, the other night saying this is for pizza. And we haven't actually, uh, we actually hadn't had it yet. But this is uh, us finally, finally having it. Are you coming back, Shell? Okay, let's just ignore that, Shell. Let's go to it. I could... Go take out. Should I take out the wizards and come back and get this Koopa? I think I'm just going to risk it. Maybe that was a bad idea. No! This is such a tough level. Stampy needs veggie support for this level. <laughs> that was funny. It was stream the other day. Shout out to, to people who remember veggie support. And fruit support. Right, this might be it. This might be it. Land on here. No! Was this it? Oh! And he's done it! And he has done it! Oh dear, that was uh, that was quite the level. It wasn't even like a really, really tricky level. I was just really, really bad at it. But like, I, I'd got close enough so many times, I felt like determined to uh, to be able to to make it through. <laughs> right then, let's do a couple more levels, and then I'm gonna go and uh, eat the the pizza. Uh, Reflection River from Frosty Losty. It's gonna be the the level we're gonna play uh, back. Uh, it's way easier. Uh, also, happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you for the birthday wishes. Uh, wishes. Right. K, P, F. Uh, 3G, K. Um, 4, Q, G. All right. That's it on the, the screen. If anyone wants to play the level as well. Should be called Reflection River if I got the code right. There we go. Not everything has a reflection. Use the question mark blocks to your advantage. All right then, let's uh, give it a go. From uh, Tyler Bros, this level's done by. Oh wait, no, it's not my it's not my birthday today. Uh, it's my birthday on Friday. Oh, I've just, I've only really just realized the reflect, look at the reflection in the water. How cool is that? Ah, oh, then are we going to go back the way we came, but swimming? Very smart. Very, very, very smart. I like this. Normally not a fan of water levels, but I will, I will accept it because it's such a cool idea. Oh, why is the arrow pointing down that way? Oh, is it just because it's like the reflection? <laughs> just because it's the, the other way around. <laughs> it's pizza time, says, um, uh, lol men gamer. Oh. Maybe I should have focused on it. Small channel says, uh, hashtag Team Stampy, you are great. Thank you so much. Right, so where am I actually meant to be going here? So I can't go down through this pipe. This one's blocked. I guess, I, uh, are we trying to fire? Oh, are we going to get a POW block that we're going to use to break that, do you reckon? Because there's the same underneath there. I'm pretty sure I need to swim back the, uh, the way I came. And these are here, but I don't think I can do anything with them. 
I don't think there's any way I can get past this guy though, is there? Anyone have any uh, any ideas in the in the chat? So I, I can't like ground pound this or anything, can I? I can't swim under it. You don't reckon I can go up this pipe, do you? Yee nope. <laughs> go the other way. Go which way? Can't just say go the other way. I need I need more I need more information than that. Go under him. I can't fit under him, can I? There are differences uh, differences between the real one and the the reflection. Oh. Oh, was it just like a hidden P switch here? Oh, I see. I get it. Because there was this block here, it means there should have been one on the other side as well. Okay, I get it. I get it. Okay, that was me being me being silly. I think I've worked it out now, though. So, because, look, if I jump up here, there should be a hidden block. There is, because there was one on the underneath. Right, now we need to swim back around the, the other side. Uh, let's just switch this so we can go back up to the top if we need to. Oh, hello, Bobby Ross. Uh, here's a donation, uh, not about a diss track. Uh, sorry about the FTC situation. I uh, love you from childhood to teens. Uh, Big Bobby, thank you so much. Welcome back to uh, another stream. Can I just make my way through now? I can. Alright, looks like are we looking for um, a power block maybe? So do I need, I think, do I need to do the switch again? Alright, I can't get back up to the top again here. Is there like a block here? Aha, there is. And then this is going to blow up this guy. I've got to be careful to do this in the right place. <laughs> then this will allow me to go through the door. This level is awesome. This is cool. You know what? Smelling that pizza's made me so hungry. I, I was not hungry at all. And the squishy's probably that pizza. And now, like, my belly's just like, wait, wait a minute, Stampy, you just smell pizza. Normally, like, we have the smelling of the pizza directly followed by the eating of the pizza. And my belly's going, excuse me, you seem to be forgetting a, an important part of the pizza. <laughs> Can I know? Oh, do I need to smash the power block above water and then it breaks it through the water? It looks like I can't do uh, power blocks like while under the water. Uh, David and Jamie, thank you so much uh, for the donation. Saying they uh, they love the the streams. Glad you're enjoying them. Right, so yeah, I think if I do it here, there we go. And now if I go under, I'll be able to make my way through. Hmm. Oh, okay. Solved my problem. Uh, then if I go around for the other side... I love the look of this level as well. I love the, the design of it. Uh, I'm not sure what the uh, the toppings were on the, the pizza. We normally just get like loads of like peppers and like onion and sweet corn and stuff. I'm a sucker for uh, barbecue pizzas as well. I don't think that was. But uh, yeah, I love a barbecue pizza. 
I'm just gonna start a huge, a huge debate about the uh, the best toppings for pizza now, aren't I? <laughs> uh, right, what was different with the uh, the picture above? I can't see any blocks anywhere. I'm kind of stuck in this room. Oh, I wonder if I go here, is that gonna reveal anything? No. Oh, I can get back out, can't I? Okay, looks like I might just need to zigzag my way through here. All right, it's gonna be tricky. I haven't got any, any mushrooms. Go, 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 go. One little cheeky extra bonus coin. Actually, you know what? Oh, I bet if I went round to the top, there'd have been a really good like power up or something in that uh, in that top bit. Oh, here's the uh, the argument for the uh, the best pizza. It will always ultimately turn into like, should you have pineapple on pizza or not? The uh, <laughs> the famous old argument. <laughs> All right, I think I'll do one more level, uh, and then I'm going to go and eat my pizza, speaking of pizza. Like, every time I say pizza, it just makes me even more hungry. Uh, I was watching you since I was a little girl, but I'm now 18. Thank you for watching so long. Uh, Sakuroid. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that somewhat accurately. <laughs> you know who you are. Uh, my level in a shoe factory, uh, says Asher. All right, let's check out their level in a shoe factory. Certainly unique. Not played any other shoe factory levels today. Right, so this is from uh, from Asher. The uh, the code is up on the the screen. Uh, this is going to be the the last level that I do. So uh, don't worry about sharing any more codes. I will probably do a uh, another Super Mario Maker stream at some point in the the future, uh, where I will be able to to play more levels. The shoe factory. Oh, very low percentage clear rate. This might be a tricky one. Once upon a time, there was a boot with a point. Uh, is this going to be one of the ones where like you're in the shoe and you can like jump on the spikes and stuff? Please stream you watching the pizza. Do you mean watching or eating? Because <laughs> streaming me watching the pizza would be like torture. It'd just be me staring at the pizza, like, just drooling. <laughs> so there's an arrow here? Why is there an arrow here? Oh, that, oh, that's where I get the shoe from. Okay. I now have the shoe. Does the shoe let me jump on lava? No. <laughs> it was worth it for the experiment. I mean you eating. <laughs> I assumed you meant me, uh, meant me meat eating. I'm not gonna stri- I hate streams of people eating. You don't wanna sit there and me go nom, 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 with pizza. It's gonna make all of you starving. All right, do I just need to do like a really big jump here? Okay. Now where do I go from here? Can I make that jump up to the left up there? Hmm. What do you reckon, guys? Is, am I missing something, or is that just like a really like tall jump I need to make? Hmm. A lot of people like died around there. Oh, jump out of the shoe. Ah, I see. So I have to get some new shoes. So I just go like that, and then like. Oh, do I have to press like uh, R to jump out the the shoe? Let me just do a little test. So okay, yeah. So I go. Oh, <laughs> not like that. I wonder if I should still try and jump over to the right first. Uh, how do you feel about pineapple on pizza? I think I'm quite, like, neutral. Like, I wouldn't choose to add pineapple to pizza. But if, like, if pineapple is on pizza, like, I'm not gonna burst into tears. Like, I'll eat it. <laughs> like, it, it's still pizza at the end of the day. Come on, pineapple or not, so... <laughs> like, I don't mind pineapple on pizza. Given, like, a choice of any topping. Like, I would never choose, pi like, pineapple, I don't think. Hey, There we go. Alright, let's go get my go get my new shoes. 
Oh, are you gonna give me new shoes? Oh, there we go. Uh, do I go right or left then? Let's go, let's go to the right. Okay, I can't see what's under me. Please don't kill me. Oh, I hate that. I hate blind jumps. I hate it when you're doing a jump and you don't know like what's gonna be completely underneath you if you can't see the floor or not. Like it's not tricky. You just need to like do the jump once to learn like what's there. Ooh, it looks like there's a little bonus thing on the left. I wonder if that's going to be like a, uh, a mushroom. This looks tricky, Stampy, says Helen. It is! It is tricky. It's the horrible combination of me not being very good and the level being quite tricky. <laughs> it's a horrible, horrible, dangerous combination. Right, this jump I can do just like this, though. There we go. Right, I've learned my lesson. I'm not going to stand directly under where the, uh, the shoe drops. Uh, what's type of one type of pizza you refuse to eat? Uh, I don't know. Like, like, I don't eat meat, so I guess like any meat pizza. Okay, I got a mushroom. Don't know how much that's gonna help me, because it seems to be more about me falling off and dying. So I need to like drop and then go like this and then land in there. I think I need to, like, get as far to the left as I can and, like, jump when I'm right before the lava to be able to, to get in. This is tricky. This is tricky. It's a cool idea for a level, though. I mean, they say it's a shoe factory. I don't... <laughs> this doesn't feel like a very productive way to make shoes. Let's not even worry about the mushroom for now. I might regret that later, but let's uh, just keep going. Woo! That was tricky. That was tricky. All right, let's get myself a new shoe. This is cool. I love the little like the little mechanism for like delivering you new shoes. It's good because it takes out the the goomba. It makes it like safe to get the new shoes. All right? Is this going to be more like straightforward like parkour? Okay, do I need to go up there? Whoa, that was so good. Okay, I think I did that right. I did that. I was scared of the spikes above me, so I kind of like held back on the uh, on the jump a little bit. I think I just need to, to jump a little bit further. I'm liking this level though. Uh, do I have Instagram? I do, but I post I post to it very rarely. And it's basically just pictures of my pets. So if you want to see pictures of, uh, of my cat and dog, then that's the, the place that I go to. The place to go, I guess. Yeah, I don't really like take selfies or talk about my personal life too much. It's just very cute pictures of, uh, of my little corgi and my cat. Do I even need to press this? I don't think I even need to press. Oh, I do need to press the button. So that's what makes the shoe come out. Uh, Bobby says, seeing you smile is one of the nicest things, lol. <laughs> I'm just happy I'm able to, to keep smiling even though I'm being destroyed in the cell. So I think if I jump while it's... Oh, no. It's tricky. So when you're, like, moving and you're on something, you're just constantly, like, bouncing on the shoe. And so if you press to jump, like, while you're in the air, it won't count the jump. So when you're, like, moving up and down like that, it's just hard to, like, time the jump when you're in the shoe. Does that make any sense? I guess it kind of makes sense. It's like trying to like... Imagine you're in an elevator like going up and down and you try and jump. Like if you're jumping while it's going up, you can't jump as well, but you jump too high. Like it's, it just makes it harder to like judge it. Is it going to give me the shoe? Here we go. Uh, jump out the, the boot in the air. Uh, yeah. So I've been trying to do, but like, for this next bit here, I need to jump, like, in the boot, and then then jump out of the boot and get the, the timing right. And that's the, the tricky part. So see what I mean? See how I'm, like, I'm bouncing up and down anyway? No! Guys, it's really tricky. I don't know if I'm going to have to throw the towel in on this level. I hate to do it. I hate to do it. 
but it's a tricky one. It's just extra hard because I've got to do like all this beginning bit every time and it's just quite slow. So like I haven't had like many actual attempts on the bit I'm struggling with. Just because I've got to do this whole bit every time. And this bit ain't the uh, ain't the easiest either. <laughs> like that bit's tricky enough by itself. Petition for Stampy to wear a pair of heels during this level. <laughs> Right, I'm gonna jump when I'm a little bit higher, I think. Oh, can I not? Do the spikes not hurt your head? Like, when you're in the shoe? So I assume the shoe would just protect you from, like, spikes underneath you. Do I not have to worry about hitting my head on those spikes? Let me, let me just do a little tester here. No, okay, the spikes can hurt you when they're above you. <laughs> okay, good to know. <laughs> I was right to be cautious. Oh, what? Uh, what? What? Uh, no! Uh, excuse me! Look at Mara, he's there saying like, No! 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 I'm sorry. Okay, I can turn it off. <laughs> the way he's like squished up into that. Squishy said my heels won't fit him. He'll have to wear his own. <laughs> my secret's out. Every lovely world video I ever recorded, I was secretly wearing high heel shoes and no one knew. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! <laughs> 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 ah, it's so tricky because if I hit that first bit, I think I'm going to do one more attempt on that bit. One attempt. And then I'm going to throw the towel in because otherwise this... This is going to take all day. I'll be here at 3am and it'll be like, there'll be like one other person watching. <laughs> and I'll just be like struggling through it. <laughs> uh, jump later, someone said. I don't think, I, I don't think it's the time when I'm jumping. I think it's like the first jump. I need to get, do the first jump better where I'm not banging into the spike or like I'm making it a bit further. I think that's where the, the trouble is. I just haven't had, like, much time practicing just to get that first bit right. Uh, oh, there's a checkpoint if you can do it, says Dolly. Okay. I'm close to the chair. It's just so tough, that bit. Give me my shoes! Give me my shoes! Shoes! There we go. Getting pretty good at that bit. Struggle with that bit at first. I'm definitely getting better at that bit. I'm not sure when I if I should jump when this thing's at the top or the bottom. So if I jump when it's too high, I'm just gonna bang those spikes above me. So I'm gonna do one more go. I'm gonna do one more go. That was me trying to jump later then. It's definitely the first jump I'm messing up, not the, the second one. It's annoying with this bit as well because like normally when like I've played the beginning bit of a level a bunch of times, I can oh <laughs> it didn't kill the Goomba that time. Like normally I can just like try and rush through to get back to that bit. But like, no matter how fast I go, this bit's always just a bit slow, just because I gotta like stand here waiting for the, the the shoes to drop down. And I'm an uh, I'm an impatient man. All right, let's do it. Maybe I'm going to start from further back and try and get more of a run up. Ah, oh, I just did that thing again. Like I pressed to jump, but because I'm bouncing up and down, I, th I think I need to do it from like a stand, a standstill. 
Is anyone else in the chat doing this level? And has anyone been able to get through it? Does anyone have any, uh, any tips? Ah, I didn't kill the, uh, <laughs> I didn't kill the Gumper again. Scratchy said, yeah, I completed it first try. You don't even have Mario Maker. Yeah, I, th I think I'm going to have to do it from like a, a standstill. I just don't know whether I should do it from when it's at the top or when it's at the, the bottom. So let's try and get right to the edge. I think I've got to do it when it's at the bottom. No! Definitely jumped too early that time. I was getting panicky. Uh, wait longer before you jump out the boat. Right, I'm going to jump. try jumping way later then. I love the way like ages ago I said this was going to be my last attempt <laughs> when I just carried on playing and no one's mentioned it. Someone said use the graph. <laughs> There's some things in life that, grass are, that graphs aren't the answer for. Not many things but this may be one of them. See, if I jump too late, I'm just too low. Like, my problem isn't the distance. I'm getting the distance. I need more height. Like, jumping later isn't going to help. I'm going to maybe try jumping as the, uh, like, the shell things, like, lifting up. See if that, like, I can retain some, like, upwards momentum. Worth a try. Try the middle. Yeah, so I'm going to try. I'm going to try jumping as it's moving up. See if that allows me to get a bit more height. Oh, what? What happened then? Just fell off. Guess my shoes didn't fit. Uh, I jumped when I was in the, the middle. Like, going up or going down? Going up, I assume. Just nerd pile up, someone said. <laughs> Things are much simpler in Minecraft than other games. I think maybe the problem is I'm only wearing one shoe. If you tried walking with just one shoe, it'd be very difficult. I think I just need to find the other shoe. I think the shoe's a little bit too big for me as well. Seeing as I'm like living in it like a cocoon. No! I'm messing this bit up now. I'm getting all panicky on this first bit. <laughs> I think I think I do need to do the run up, you know, because that was me trying to jump from a standstill, and I did, I hardly made any distance. So that's me jumping from like a standstill. And what happens if I do like a run up? Yeah, that's a huge difference. I think what I need to do is try to do like a run up, and just try and hope that when I bounce, I'm like on the shell and not up in the the air. I need to walk up and down a few times to see if they fit or not. Uh, did you see YouTube Rewind? I did! I thought it was alright. I think it was definitely better than last year. Like, it wasn't very, like, exciting, I guess, but... It was kind of a good way to, like, sum up the year of YouTube, I thought. Oh! Right, okay, I'm doing 100%. One final attempt, and then I'm done. 
One final go. And I'm, I'm going to commit to it this time because I said that earlier. <laughs> I'd like one final attempt at that. Not that. That one doesn't count. That one doesn't count. Obviously, that one doesn't count. But one final attempt at the bit I've been struggling with. Uh, try jumping past the weird shell guy and just jump past him. Oh, well, just try not to... I don't think I'd get enough distance if I didn't land on the shell. It's like a huge gap. Go silent to help you focus. Yeah, I might need to... <laughs> yeah, I might need to do... I did that earlier. I kept failing on one bit. And I had one, one attempt where I was just silent. And I just fully concentrated and I just nailed it the first time. Maybe I could uh, give that a go as well. Uh, are you planning to, to play more Pokemon Sword? Uh, I will do. I'm going to do a um, uh, a few battles. Uh, I think it's up. Oh, no. Oh, I didn't kill the uh, the shoe. There's a Goomba in the shoe. Give me my shoe back. Oh, it's, all, it's all warm now. It's all been stretched out and Goomba shaped. <laughs> final attempt. That doesn't count. <laughs> you knew it. I'm in final attempt on the, the bit I've been struggling with. Hey, I'll make my own rules. Right, you think just don't touch that? I, th I think i got to go. It's just too big of a distance if I don't go on this shell. Yeah, that's... Oh, no. Oh, dear. Okay, I'm done. I am done. It was a good course. I just wasn't good, wasn't good enough at it. I think if there was a check... If there was a checkpoint before that section, I think maybe I would have had a chance. It was just a little bit too difficult. Okay, well, let's just do one last of just the, uh, the popular courses. Because I can't end on a defeat. And let's try and do one of those ones that I'll actually be able to, to complete. Hmm. There's loads of like Link ones. There's so, so many Zelda ones at the moment. What's Pokey Doki? Oh, that's got a 1% clear rate. Let's not do that one. Is this just... Okay, let's just end on a, a nice a nice music Christmas Jingle Bell Rock level, shall we? like the the music ones where they like use all of like the um oh we're still going <laughs> where they use like all of like the mario sound effects as well just makes them a bit crazier done we are done well that was a nice way and yes i completed the level look how good i am at the game <laughs> it wasn't an easy level i had to hold right at several occasions during that but i was able to complete it and look i was only slightly off the world record <laughs> Uh, anyway, though, that is going to be the end of this uh, Mario Maker stream. Uh, I'll do another one. I'll do another one at some point uh, in the, the future. Uh, I'm pretty open to, to streaming different stuff at the moment. Uh, now I've, like, finished the story in uh, in Pokemon uh, in Pokemon Sword. Like, that was, like, the main game I've been streaming. So uh, until I find kind of, like, a, a new single-player game that I kind of want to stick with for a little while and keep trying at it. Uh, yeah, the stream's going to be all over the place. I'm just going to be streaming all sorts of different games uh, on different days. Uh, don't know exactly which games on which days, but that's kind of part of the excitement. Whenever one of these pops up, feel free to, to click on and uh, say hello. Uh, but, yeah, apart from that, I hope everyone has a great rest of their day, and uh, I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!